your own movie that you wrote, you yeah. directed. Yeah, wrote it, directed it, edited it, put some music in it that I composed. It was really fun. It's my first time behind the camera. Uh, we have a great cast, Justin Long and Kobe Smulders and uh, John Cho, Ron Hansen, all these great folks. Uh, Justin Long, you saw at a festival. Yeah, Justin, I bumped into a festival and I just finished the script and um, had been thinking about him uh, in the in the role and uh, and just got to talking and he read it and then he, he connected. He'd had a, he, it's a film I wrote sort of partly out of my own life experience and then and then partly, you know, exaggerated and dr dramatized. What's the, the what's the premise? The premise is a guy going to his ex-girlfriend's wedding. Um, needless to say, he's a bit out of place. And uh, why you know, does he? And why does he go to the wedding? Um, this is the part where I do that. You'll have to watch to find out. <laughs> um, he, uh, you know, it's it's a mix of things. I think I, you know, if he goes for reasons unknown to himself. I mean, sort of partly maybe to win her back, but partly to show everyone that he's totally okay with this. Um, you know, it's kind of all those things. So tell me what it's like, to, you're directing all these great actors, yeah. Peter Gallagher, right. Justin Long, uh, Luis Guzman, Dana Delaney, I mean, yeah. what is that like? I, honestly, it's great, because wh when you're dealing with pros and veterans like that who really know what they're doing and they've been around the block and they've dealt with, you know, good sets, bad sets, and everything in between, they're, they're great. They know how to take care of themselves, and it's really just about you kind of keeping the train on the tracks and trying to tell the story that you want to tell and kind of, pitching the way that you saw it and then letting it go from there and letting it, you know, letting the scene take its own shape and letting these actors do the amazing things that they do. So you cast the film kind of yourself? I did the casting along with Cassandra Kulakundis, who's an amazing I know casting her. director. Do you know, know Cassandra? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, how do you know Cassandra? Uh, I know her brother. Amazing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, her brother's awesome. She's the best. She casts She's... Boogie Nights and, you know, all that. That might be the best cast movie of all Maybe time. Maybe ever, right? Maybe yeah. one of the best all-time casts. So she's, needless to say, phenomenal and works her butt off. Um, so she's great. I, sat, and I, I saw her on a flight like uh, three years ago, quick Cassandra anecdote. I hadn't seen her in years. She's sitting next to me on a flight and I'm really hungover because I just been eliminated from Last Comic Standing. And I had like a, I had like a duel with Keen and Ivory Wayans. We went back and forth and right. he, he like insulted me and yeah. then I said, he said, like, why well, like some of your jokes? Why well, didn't like all of them? Yeah. And I said, well, I liked all your scary movie films, sarcastically, right, obviously. Right, 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 right. And it got, a, it got a big pop. Yeah. And not here, apparently. But uh, <laughs> at, uh, at the actual taping. You should have been there. But, it was hilarious. But uh, so the next morning, I'm like, I'm like bummed. I'm, I'm on the flight. I turn to her, and she's just like, how are you? I'm like, ah, not well. She's like, well, I'm horrible. And she told this whole story about her friend dying. I was like, oh, well, never oh, mind. No. And I was hungover, so in the middle of her story about her friend dying, I just fell asleep. 